In Washington, explosive allegations leaked to the New York Times. Sources have reported House Speaker Kevin McCarthy made it clear he has little faith in Lubbock Congressman Jody Arrington. Now some lawmakers on both sides of the aisle are coming to the House budget chair's defense. The infighting is gaining national attention. KCBD News Channel 11's Shaylee Sanders breaks down the allegations and the backlash. Harsh words and division reported among the House Budget Committee as it works to balance the nation's checkbook. This New York Times article claims House Speaker Kevin McCarthy has no confidence in House Budget Chair Jody Arrington when it comes to delivering a budget framework. The New York Times did not disclose its sources, but reported that McCarthy regarded Arrington as incompetent. The Times reports the statements were made during private conversations with colleagues, but McCarthy did undercut Arrington in front of reporters just weeks ago. Arrington had told reporters he was preparing a term sheet detailing a form list of spending cuts Republicans would demand from the White House in exchange for their support in raising the debt ceiling. When asked about the offer, McCarthy told reporters, I don't know what he's talking about. According to the Times, a grudge may be behind McCarthy's remarks. Sources told the Times Arrington began floating the idea of Steve Scalise of Louisiana challenging McCarthy for the House speakership. The Times reported McCarthy also made comments about Scalise, calling the majority leader ineffective, checked out, and reluctant to take a position on anything. Some lawmakers are voicing support for Arrington and Scalise, saying they are McCarthy's scapegoats. A senior House Republican told NBC News McCarthy has, quote, made zero progress in debt negotiations and is getting nervous because he knows all these secret side deals and promises he made during his speaker race are not going to pan out. Representative Brendan Boyle of Pennsylvania, the top Democrat on the budget committee, told NBC News the failure lies with McCarthy. Republicans took raising the debt limit hostage and yet have no idea what ransom they want for it. Kevin McCarthy promised the sun, moon and stars to his Republican colleagues in order to get elected speaker. Now that he can't even produce a GOP budget, he's shifting the blame onto other Republican colleagues. Shaley Sanders, KCBD, News Channel 11.